to climb their way out of the bottom of the conference. Inside to Bailey, nice post move and the finish. Only the lead wide open and exciting this season for a lot of those teams picked, you know, maybe in the lower half to, to certainly finish higher than their preseason poll. Bailey gets her own board, knocks it down, and will go to the free throw line. When Janelle Bailey gets this deep in the post, you're going to have difficulty stopping her. Even with two, you see post players for Illinois. Coons is averaging just under 15. Again, five players on this Carolina team averaging over 10 points a game. And already, Janelle Bailey has nine. Probably for Tina Thompson's team, the point guard duties have been a little bit up in the air. You think yes. she brings something positive just in that respect and filling that role as Carolina's on the board. Nice post-to-post -post look there at Shatinge with the early deuce. Certainly adequate substitutes. Coonan inside for Janelle Bailey. A little turnaround jumper is good. Got Jamira Williams back. She had a surgery and had to sit out for several weeks. But in anticipation of getting her back, Coach Tina Thompson really trying to retool the offense, not be a one and done on the offensive end. Coonan finds the cutting Bailey. Bucket and the foul. Yeah, only back into the game for, what, less than a minute. This is Coonan again with it. Gives it up to Muhammad. Haley out of the high post, high low action, and Chitenge goes over Chitenge, and the Hokies do in fact have the lead back. Haley from 16 feet, got it. Really good at that. We saw in the opens. Cole on the inbound, guarded by the much bigger Bailey. And she tried to throw it off. Bailey threw it right to her, throws it ahead to Bennett, and Bennett will make the mistake hurt. Trying to bang it off the leg and missed of Bailey. Good recognition read down floor from Bailey. He's for Koenig, second best in school history. Janelle Bailey. Three point shots. Seven points for Koenig, first quarter. Bailey wants another three. All about the triples is Janelle Bailey, the post player, knocks one down for UNC. Knocked away by Bailey. Muhammad potential two on one. Bennett fills the lane and lays it in. Isn't a good matchup for her size-wise, strength, athleticism, all taken into consideration. That was a six-footer from Tallahassee. That was a perfect pass to Coonan. Battling against Dunham, who's a good defensive player for Louisville. Dunham did all she could, but right on cue to China, Bailey gets the bucket. She's one of those blue-collar workers who is does the dirty work. Bailey with a nice spin move. He has gone to the bench. Bailey over Hermosa rounds it in. Carson, baseline, rejected from behind by Coonan. Taylor Coonan kicks it. Muhammad sticks it. Some of them will put a harder schedule out there. Test my players. Let's see what we're made of. Other ones may put together a little bit of an easier schedule. Let's get some W's and build some confidence. Both ways work. We're going to take Willoughby away. Who's going to be the second option? She's saying, I will. I'll take it. Going right at the basket. But they just can't stop the Tar Heels down low tonight, Dean. Bennett hands it off to Bennett who got the two and will shoot a free throw. The pace of this game has picked up in the third quarter. Open bucket and then here, Bennett off of the drive, draws an extra defense. Banghart mentioned to me this morning, said her fall away shot is so dangerous and we cannot stop it. This is the player she was worried about. North Carolina right back. Points in that first quarter yet to score here in the second quarter. Thinking about it here, though, trying to beat Kitley to the rim, and she does it, and the chance at the old school three-point play for Bailey. Becomes so much better at putting the ball on the floor. Look at that, turns and faces, dribbles. It was able to get that pass right over the top to Malouk. Got it, one of the best in the ACC in terms of assists. That's another turnover. Coonan at it again defensively for the Tar Heels, and she'll take two. Conti here just loses the handle. 